The 2019 Chevrolet Blazer SUV was quietly removed from Comerica Park this morning. The move comes after outrage that the new model is not American made and Action News first told you about this controversy earlier in the week when the Blazer was added to the display. But General Motors quietly made the change despite the backlash. All of this coming as the automaker is under pressure from President Trump over plant closures in the U.S. And Action News reporter Ali Hoxie joins us live from Comerica with all the latest details. Hi, Ali. Hi, we did get a statement from GM stating in part that they wanted to make this switch so that people could enjoy opening day without controversy. I think it was a strategic move on their part. This Chevrolet Traverse now sits in place of where a 2019 Chevrolet Blazer SUV used to sit. But just a few days ago, the Blazer was set in place at Comerica Park. When news spread that the SUV is made in Mexico, controversy ensued. This comes on the heels of the GM Detroit Hamtramck and Warren transmission plants set to close within a few months. Because of the message that they had about the car closings, I think that's more positive for GM than it was. What you can do is make the decision they made today and put that American made car out and kind of correct any mistake they might have made in the past. A spokesperson for General Motors sent us the following statement. We want people to enjoy baseball without distractions. So we are going to replace the Chevrolet Blazer with a Chevrolet Traverse at the Comerica Park Fountain. American workers contribute significantly to the success of the Chevrolet Blazer. The Blazer will pump more than half a billion dollars into the U.S. manufacturing economy each year, helping support thousands of good paying U.S. jobs. I think it's a very smart move. I did speak with a spokesperson for the UAW. He told me through email that they were informed that the switch was going to happen. Reporting live in downtown Detroit, Ali Hoxie, 7 Action News.